Apparently Twitch sings at a 2080 songs. Dude, today. please read them. Um, I've already launched it. Yeah, 2080. What do they think this is? Cyberpunk? <laughs> this is one of them Electric Eye. Oh. Judas Priest. That's the drum part. I gave Twitch Sings. Uh, I, I'm just going to keep oh, tweeting I saw. them. Yeah. yeah, I gave them my, my wish list, and they need to listen. Please. Hmm. I think they should Have add... Have you messaged your account manager? <laughs> I think they should uh, add some rap songs from the year 2019. Yes. Oh, I fucking suck. Uh, oh, I wanna fuck. Uh, shoot me in the gut. Uh, mucky, mucky, muck. Uh. <laughs> what? what I was Sorry, I I entered a fugue state for a second. I think you were singing Wonder Boy there. For a second. <laughs> Down in the mucky muck. Oh. Hi. Ryan, yeah. can you ban the wrenches who aren't subscribed to you? Dude, I'm extremely so pro wrench. I don't want to, with six people in the call, I don't want to dominate conversation too much, but I was talking about how yesterday I uh, got a copyright strike on YouTube and I emailed my direct manager at Google to be like, hey, what the fuck? And he didn't get back to me for 36 hours. And on Twitch, if I ever tweet, it, that I'm like, eh, I had a bad day on Twitch today. Like, eight staff are up in my mentions, like, what can we do to help you? <laughs> in, like, two seconds. That's, like, a big deal over on YouTube. Yeah, I mean, what man! Would the equivalent be, uh, on Twitch, what would be the equivalent of that? I mean, like, literally, I guess, just getting a copyright strike, but... There's not really anything like that that happens all that often on this platform. I know, it's a... It, and on YouTube, it's a huge deal, but I was like, yeah. Man, I've got a contact they, they at Google. me a warning. Once. Oh, for music? No, it was... Not for music. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you gotta say, bud. That sounds good. I think I've asked my partner manager for something like ten times over the past year, and I think nine out of those ten times he's been able to do it, and only once has he been like, "No, nah, we can't do that." That's an insane ratio. That is yeah. pretty good, especially depending on what you've been asking him to do for you. Oh, like definitely, like nine of them were rivals. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Must be nice. God. I just finished Arrivals. Yeah. yeah. Stardew Valley, wasn't it? Yeah, it was fun, but we did horrible. <laughs> did, I, I'm reading what you were saying, and I I am literally not surprised in any fashion whatsoever. No, not at all. How do I sound, by the way? Do I sound the same? You sound great. Yeah, you sound great. Yeah. Good. Better than ever. Silky. It is new, man. I get it. Oh. It's... Does oh, Twitch much. know you're using a mixer? <laughs> when, I, when I tweeted about it, everybody, or like probably 10% of the people that replied to me on Twitter were like, I thought you were talking about a kitchen mixer for the entire tweet. Until the end. <laughs> oh, this is going to be fun. It's like, this guy can't fucking stream without having a smoothie. Oh, wow. Real spoiled there. <laughs> I like that you would use a mixer to make a smoothie yeah, no, too. I, well, that's what someone said. I just I took it out. Everyone will vote on which they like most. It's simple. You score. I want to get a mixer, but I also want to spend an extra one hundred dollars just to have someone else set the whole thing for me. I'll come do it. That is worth it, man. Cause fuck this shit. I'm so done with all this. <laughs> Dude, I am an idiot when it comes to sound. Well, like, that's what uh, Geek Squad is there for. You pay them a hundred bucks, they'll set up your Xbox. If you lived closer, I would come set up all your audio. So yeah, I was gonna oh, lie. Yeah. I was, I was going to lie when I said I'll come do it. It's, it's like 14 hours or something. Yeah. I think. yeah. No, it's, it's farther because oh. I'm not used to it anymore. 16 hours. <sighs> James Franco. I was extremely lucky, and my buddy Tom, who helps me move here to Florida, is also an audio engineer. Wow. So we just went to Guitar Center, and he was like, buy this, buy this, buy this, buy this. And then we Dude, came back, uh, and he set it all up. Like, Good fucking friend to have, man. I'll tell you what. Someone that knows all that shit. It, I, was, yeah. I was telling you guys, like, I I went to school for this stuff, not particularly to, like, learn exactly how the mixer operates, okay, but even being around all these people and trying to osmosis this information, it's still such a foreign concept to actually approach okay, everyone, fixing this favorite. thing, you know? Like, I have no idea how it works. Isn't how you use a mixer is, like, when they start sounding good, you nod your head, and then you just slide all the sliders up to the top? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> a trick you shouldn't teach your dog. Setting up a mixer 
If other answer is stream on Twitch, vote this. Everyone I know who has a mixer, at, when they start streaming, they go, oh, my blank turned all the knobs again. And it's like cat, <laughs> yeah. sun, the something, dog, and Windows it's like, update. Are you guys all just like really bad at using mixers and blaming it on pets and, and children? It's like when YouTubers say that the scheduled uploader broke. I've been using that thing for a fucking decade. It's the one part of that <laughs> cursed the website that never breaks. <laughs> yeah. A movie that, that should never be movie. made into a theme park ride. Bird Box or Seven? So I wrote Seven, but I feel like Bird Box would be a worse ride, because you'd be blindfolded. What? <laughs> what is Bird Box? <laughs> the ride? I thought it would gone with a pornography, the name of a pornography movie, probably. Seven Dude, that... has a naked lady in it. Oh. You're kind of tapping into something with this Bird Box theme park ride, yeah, though, because man. that'd be like the cheapest ride of all time. It's just an audio experience, and you push groups through in fucking shopping carts in an empty hallway. That's what I was thinking! You play sounds around them Just a bunch you know? of fans, like, blowing wind in their face? Yeah. The big crazy twist at the end of the next M. Night Shyamalan movie. He was edging the whole time. Or he was fuck this prompt the whole time. If he was directing a porno, then yeah, the first answer would be really surprising. I don't the care if I won, I didn't like it. It would be really surprising, because he would still be getting paid directing gigs. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Actually, I heard, heard, you know, this new stuff is a little bit more interesting. The worst thing to find frozen <laughs> in an ice cube. The worst thing to find frozen in an ice cube. Your fears or Brendan Fraser? They're the What's same. The difference. Yeah. <laughs> that Encino Man throwback. It is a reference to Encino Man. It's actually a really fun movie, and I love it. If you don't like it, it's okay. You're wrong. You don't <laughs> use was, the juice. It was one of my favorite movies as a youth. <laughs> it should still be one of your favorite movies, though. I haven't seen it long enough to know. Like, I, I always feel weird, like, so I, when I went back and watched The Breakfast Club when I was, like, 20, I hadn't seen this when I was a little kid, yeah. I didn't realize how many, how much context I missed. Mm. Like, the fact that they smoke weed and, like, hang out all cool and stoned, and when I was a kid, I was like, oh, they're just happy. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, I'm wow. wondering if I watch Encino Man today, am I going to gleam all sorts of new shit I missed, because I was a stupid kid. But you still don't wheeze the juice, brother. You never wheeze the juice. Never. Also, those kids are criminals. A rejected name for the Segway, the Ancient Chariot of Ulamog, or Leg Day. We're talking about, like, a horror movie now, where it, it's just a monster movie, but the monster is just Brendan Fraser. On a Segway? And, and he's not trying to be scary or anything, he just is Brendan Fraser. He he's wants a role in your the movie you're making, and you don't yeah. want to give it to him. <laughs> <laughs> It centers around the casting director just trying to avoid <laughs> Brendan Fraser. Haunted by the specter of Brendan Fraser. Shows up at his house at like 10 p.m. Next up, <laughs> if evolution is true, like a box of chocolates and flowers. Like Please, consider me for your face. next film. <laughs> if evolution is true, then why hasn't Austin evolved into a dumb dog? Or if hey. evolution is true, then why hasn't Geodude evolved into... Geodude. I thought it was gonna let me do it twice. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't then, know what had to go in the first box. Then why well, what hasn't was Geodude going to evolve into? Then why hasn't know. Geodude evolved into? Oh fuck! It's Graveler. You have to trade Graveler to get Golem. Though. You have to trade Graveler to get a Golem. Yes. They haven't changed that yet, have they? No, it's the. It, it, you, know, you still have to. You gotta trade. Same with Gengar. Gang, you gotta trade Haunter, Graveler, Machoke, and Kadabra. And also, the Alolan version of Graveler is also electric type as well. Yeah, yeah he's got corn stuck in him. Everything is worth. Yeah, it's real very very weird. <laughs> Who's the coolest at the OG 150? Oh, that's a good dude. I really like Machamp. He's just a you ripped too. dude with four arms. <laughs> I don't like how much you like Machamp. I like Gengar. But I, I respect Machamp. To put yourself in that kind of shape and keep yourself there, that's elite training. <laughs> you just respect a person. You, you just turn this into a human quality. He has four arms. What's the... not Growlithe, but his... Uh, oh, Arcanine. Uh, Arcanine. He's pretty dope. Also cool, I agree. Machamp also has more arms than hair, which I can relate to. It's aspirational. 
So like I only got into that Rivals last night at midnight. Ooh. So we didn't have much prep time, but I was supposed to have my roof ripped off today. Oh my god. By like a oh, monster or a, a hurricane? <laughs> <laughs> But uh, thankfully, it's been rescheduled because of the rain. The worst 1960s teen movie was definitely Exposed Ankles Beach or Quaalude Beach. <laughs> Who spelled Quaalude right? Yeah, right? dude, that's impressive. That's amazing. Did they use Google for help? That's what I want to know. <laughs> that's a hard word to spell. I gotta bring back the fucking Quaaludes. I don't. I've seen The Wolf of Wall Street, but I don't get it. It's not even even if, would they still be good even if they were around at this point? Like I don't know, age. Uh, you should listen to this guy explain. You you blow in the back real quick. Yeah, most old people I've met who played with Quaaludes sing their praises pretty high. <laughs> Make up a name for the space between your nostrils. The snooch, or it's actually already called the gooch. It's a one-two prompt. It is a one-two prompt. Call and response. Justin, have you ever purchased anything on the dark web? No. Good question. I was never. How a dark do web. you even well, uh, do that? All right. Are you a dark cop? Web. Well, I just thought if any of us had purchased anything on the dark web, it's likely. <laughs> it's <laughs> likely as to have I been will Justin. Say, Next. I got as close as making a Bitcoin wallet. Okay. And like being like, maybe I could buy things on it. <laughs> but then I read an article that was like, everyone's getting arrested, and I was like, yeah, it's not worth. It. Well, you could have bought legal things on the dark web. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you could <laughs> technically torrent things legally. Yeah. I mean, if you are Taylor Swift, you could torrent your own album. Oh, I no, but I mean, there are some, some things that like use a P2P thingy to download this. I had That's it true. back in school. Dude, would they arrest Taylor Swift for pirating her own album? They can't arrest her. She's above the law. That's true. Would they arrest me for downloading my album? Mm, yeah, no, probably. it's free. They'd make you go to yeah. copyright school. <laughs> How was the video, man? Happy oh, bro, it's really incredibly <laughs> patronizing. <laughs> Meanwhile, E1 doesn't have to watch shit. I don't want to go in too hard on E1, though, because they made John Wick 3, which is a great film. Something well, you shouldn't... Well, I mean, they signed the checks. Something you shouldn't get your significant other for Valentine's Day. Not not cum or penne. The answer was Dragonite, by the way. As the coolest Pokemon? That's the coolest of the 150. Dude, bear. Dragonite I got a shiny Dragonite. Shiny teddy bear dragon. In Pokemon shiny Go. Dragonite. I got a shiny oh, Dragonite in Pokemon Go. I love that. I fucking hatched it, bro. That's my son. Oh, oh shit. Man, I'm slacking. I, I ain't got no gifts for anyone. I didn't today. want to bring it up, but I've been suspiciously uh, ungifted from Justin recently. I've been busy the last two days. <laughs> Little known fact, the fourth wise man gave baby Jesus the worst <laughs> gift of all. An Apple Watch or the gene that makes cilantro taste bad? Cilantro? Cilantro? Y'all? 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 Excuse me? Motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> we should call Wednesday off for the rest of human existence, or is all downhill from here? Yeah, over the hump, downhill. That makes sense. What about it's free just Friday? Lame AF. What's AF stand for? As free. Ass fucking. I don't know. It's really whatever you want it to be. As fox. <laughs> Ass fox. Ass fox. Yep. <laughs> It's ambiguously phrased. I like Wednesdays, except, you know, that is the day that I got a copyright strike and had to go to copyright school. <laughs> That's forever tainted. <laughs> <laughs> Truly the darkest Wednesday. And now, round three, the Probably the worst Wednesday in human existence. You too yeah. wrote that song Trump about it. Is... The best line. Wimpy Wednesday. Wednesday, Wimpy Wednesday. Made into a, a major key song? Well, he, he he at one point he goes high and then he goes low on the next pass. Oh, here's the guy in chat who says none of you work real jobs, so what does a Wednesday mean? Oh. There's always some guy who reminds the streamer that? that they're streaming. Wow. I work at the garbage factory. You wouldn't understand what it's like. The best line to say when you come out of a 10-year coma. <laughs> I'm so hard. 
Can't watch to can't wait to watch my favorite Isaac YouTuber. What's up? Or yes we can. Yes we can. <laughs> is that is that Obama's uh, that, that is, is Obama's presidential uh, campaign slogan, yeah. Okay, all right. Really good. In two thousand I I can't wait for Biden's slogan. I, I mean we could. <laughs> 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 That's a good joke. It's a good joke. joke. <laughs> a good joke. Good. I like that. I can't believe a mere 269 votes is determining the fate of this game <laughs> right now. Uh, what's up in last place by far? Pardon so me. It. That was that was good and topical, and you know it was on point with the timing, but oh, also boy, still not ago. funny. No, it's just like it wasn't funny. When it became a thing, and then, like, even ironically, it's not funny. But it's funny because it's, like, 20 years old. So it would have been even dated when he came out. So it's, like, the first thing you said was a joke to something that was old when you went That's into the coma. Now for the yeah. I was just thinking having a boner while you're sleeping for 10 years would be terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. You, know? you had to have some sleep loss uh, during that. Yeah. <laughs> Technical term. Sleep what? Yeah, I like that. I have never heard that before. Sleep cock. Yeah, wet there, dream. I'm Schmitty, and I truly hope that you all consider Sleep me to be cocking. Do you have wet dreams when you're in a coma? Because this game has Probably. I bet you do. Oh, man. Do you think their That's pants are just a mess? So Especially if somewhere. I'm here to I wouldn't want to check them. That's all right. Yeah. <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> Gross. Oh, I don't know. This one is just mean spirited. Well, that's half the fun. Half the fun is just saying mean things. Yeah. Or like sometimes it'll give me an answer or a question, I should say. This is in Jeopardy. And I'll go, uh, I'll come up with the worst, most offensive answer in my head. And then I'll laugh and I'll go, eh, I can't write that. Then I'll write, like, you know, Zootopia. <laughs> but I keep the real answer in my head. And yeah, I laugh and I laugh and I laugh. So you admit that you're a jerk. Yep. I try to be nicer, but it's really easy to be rude. Mostly because people are very easily offended by jokes that are mean-spirited and at their expense. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> Which is pretty <laughs> fucked up, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> Something in a weirdo's bedroom. Ryan's okay, dad or John Travolta? <laughs> <laughs> What's the difference? What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> I like the implication that either my dad is in the bedroom with the weirdo, or that any bedroom my dad is in <laughs> is Becomes weird. So weirdo bed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Took him two hours, but he got me back. <laughs> No, a lesser-known no, no, no. knight of the round table. Sir Chaddington or oh, Sir places. Dudenstein Candyman? I'm to go over a Game of Thrones joke here, but this just felt too easy <laughs> and not funny. You guys don't watch Dan's uh, MLB 19 The Show? Sir Dudenstein <laughs> Candyman! Oh, okay. <laughs> My guy ended up being country breakfast dirtbag. <laughs> <laughs> I loved hearing it every time he came up to the plate. I'm uh, Ryan, big dog. A great birthday enemy. present for your worst enemy. A bullet or pants that are the wrong size. Then they have to go take them back. It's, it's a whole chore, man. Yes, yeah. Just put them in the you shredder. In line. If you don't do anything with them, there's just fucking pants in your house. Probably left them on the floor. They're sitting there and pissing you off. Like, I How are they deal with these fucking pants. How are they the wrong size? Like in the waist or the legs? No, Dude, they feel kids. like they're about to be the right size, but then you pull them on up and they are just like two inches too wide around the waist. And the belt would work, but you have to pull it so tight that like, is it even worth it? Yeah. Dude, what would you, how would you react if like you opened a birthday present from somebody and they were of sound mind, but it was just jeans made for a child. <laughs> like it just gave you like a boy's jeans. <laughs> and we're like very genuinely enthusiastic about it. As yeah, they, opening hey, why don't you try them on? <laughs> a business or service that shouldn't have a drive through window. A drive through factory or Alcoholics Anonymous. 
But if it's a drive through factory... No, I'm just gonna roll with that, man. I voted for it. Shouldn't, shouldn't it have a drive Shouldn't it serve alcohol? I'm just trying to understand, like, what the first one... It's, it's like the factory that makes miniature versions of factories. How are you gonna fit a drive through through a drive through? <laughs> <laughs> a movie with Matt Damon? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like downsizing. Something it'd be fun to watch, ride an escalator. A floppy seal or another escalator on top of it. <laughs> okay, I like both of these equally. I don't know how to pick. I'd watch a floppy seal ride anything. Oh, Ryan! That's not gross. You're so horny today. That's not gross! <laughs> Oh, you didn't this guy's freaking horny? <laughs> Inherently horny, dude. That was not Hump meant to be was horny. Day yesterday, bud. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's really giving her out there. <laughs> Mouth, come on. What? what did he say? Something naughty? He's so horny. <laughs> <laughs> He's so horny. <laughs> the name of the worst baby doll. Barbie or poor and ugly Rebecca? <laughs> I love how much I hate it. <laughs> she loved to get down with the dirty talk. She's always said, uh, "Why eat it? Fuck." <laughs> <laughs> Didn't want you to do me because you're the yo-yo master. <laughs> do me yo-yo. <laughs> <laughs> it's great, great movie. It's great, great anything. movie. Great. She movie. just kept yoing. <laughs> Oh. That's all for round one. It's uh, that's from Forty Year Old Virgin. Stormy Daniels is in that. Is she? Yeah. Is it, is it her boob that pops out in the speed dating scene? No, two. like when he he's actually Twice watching that. Um, Paul Wait Red a minute, he, she was the one the president paid not to talk about the relationship. Yeah. yeah. I always get her confused. This is depressing and horny. <laughs> wow, that's a rare combo. Is that? That's, that means it's a I good answer, it's right? It's usually one and the same. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I don't care if I'm not American, Chad. He's still my president. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 I appreciate that. Uh, the, <laughs> the best possible reaction to that. He's the second most powerful man in my life after the president of the local chamber of commerce two, two people, people from history, history that, that should definitely have sex, sex. Mm -hmm. uh, this is what we're here for today madonna and beck or me and anyone feels badman beck and madonna as a power couple would be called madonna mm. or mm. madon beck mm. or beck or Mecdonna. Dude, Mecca! <laughs> oh, Mecca. Mecca. Donna Mabek? Mecca Donna. An expensive car would get. <laughs> a vanity license plate a jerk in an expensive car would get. Fist in rich or big dick? Those were ones, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> it, it took the ones away from me. You said that like someone from New Zealand. Yep. He's got a, he's got a big dick. He's not, <laughs> he's not got eight dicks, are you? <laughs> he's got two dicks. He's got eight legs. <laughs> it won with 69%. That's, good. That's wholesome. A better name for a corset. A better name for a corset. Time to vote. A boulder holder or a forset? Forset. 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 Did you guys see the post of the uh, Vancouver supercar and the license plate was hentai? <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I, I think I, I actually like it. I love this city as it was created by God. I want everybody who lives here except me and my wife and our extended family to die. <laughs> and just leave us alone with the rest of it. <laughs> you feel like that'd be more problematic than you think? Oh, probably. Vote on your devices. Yeah, he's gonna... <laughs> Have you thought through the consequences of everyone in the city of Vancouver dying, Ryan? I mean, be honest. The service workers can stay, too. Little known facts. The scariest animal in the world is the gun cobra or the floppy seal cobra. How are they going to steal my floppy seal? 
Oh, you're gonna steal my floppies. Oh, yeah, you're gonna steal. I've stolen your floppies. I reappropriated it. Oh, it got trapped. Yeah, gun. Oh. That oh. floppy seal is only good for one. Justin losing to gun and a clip lag. I thought of Justin when I picked that answer. I was like, what was Justin? I'm glad when you think of gun, you think of me. The dark web guns. Make up a word that means to make up a word. Hyper explainia or quip lashing? Actually, I do have some Pokemon Go gifts. I forgot I did go out yesterday. I just never sent them. But one of them is for the gun mural again, which is my favorite <laughs> gift to send to anyone. It's just a painting of a gun. <laughs> it's a Pokestop. Florida fucking sucks. Dude, no joke. I have like a, I have like a hierarchy of uh, gifts. So like, most of my gifts are from the same couple of locations. But I get one or two choice gifts a day, and I give it to whoever is most deserving. Like, I gave a couple of them to Justin because he installed the game. And I was like, hey, for your first day, take this cool gift. But Josh complained about getting the same Pokestop gift like 10 days in a row. You know what he's getting for the rest of his fucking life? The same Pokestop gift. <laughs> the title of a college admission essay that would definitely get rejected. How to seduce your professors, or why my last essay should have gotten me in. Why I shouldn't have been rejected from Harvard for the terrible things I said last year. <laughs> I was I was only a kid. Alright. <laughs> I've grown so much since 2018. <laughs> what do ceramic garden gnomes do at night? Masturbate. Sand. <laughs> <laughs> Eat the second ding. Masturbate. <laughs> they sit in the dirt, idiots. Suck days ceramic dicks off. <laughs> Fertilize. Something wholesome. I dunno, dude. Suck they ceramic dicks off. <laughs> yeah. I gave, all I my gave that all three of my votes. God no <laughs> suck. <laughs> suck they ceramic dicks off. Yo. <laughs> hey -o. There's a character in there somewhere. <laughs> right now, you, I only know one thing about him, and it's he, he says days. Yeah, instead of there. I, Malv, I'm sorry. Recalibration video. I did not. I did. I saw the tweet that introduced it, but I didn't watch the video. <laughs> Fucking insane. It's just this is like this just recalibrated. They're like, turn the light off for eight seconds. Turn it on for two seconds. Turn it on for eight seconds. Turn it off for two seconds. If you think that doesn't go on for three minutes, you need to watch the video. Because it does. And it, they didn't just repeat the recording. The dude, he voiced every line because he says it differently every time. He's like, turn it on for eight seconds. Turn it off for two seconds. Turn it on for eight seconds. I'd watch it. That's good. But watch Quaaludes first. Oh! <laughs> I don't know the other word. Take a sad day and make it better. <laughs> Remember to suck the ceramic dicks off. <laughs> <laughs> what uh, 80 songs did they add, Austin? Josh yeah, what did they add, Austin? I, yeah, Austin, Austin, yes, they add. I read them and I didn't know any of them. Can, Can you rank them? Yeah, I think Kids in America. Okay, so oh, that's a great song. All right, it's 80s week. Uh, excuse me, Austin. They have Cars by Gary Newman. Uh, how does that go? Do -do 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 get the cars. <laughs> That's Randy oh, Newman. That's Randy Newman. Fuck. Is that the "Here in My Car" song? Yeah. An Olympic sport. That, that seems like a. That's a perfect song for someone who can't sing to sing. Okay, voting time. I don't know. Why I was like, <laughs> <laughs> it's Talk the only so word that comes through. Talk my ceramic dick off in my car. An Olympic sport. That never made it. <laughs> Synchronized Sudoku or synchronized squirting? Sucking my dick while I sit in my car. <laughs> That's come on, Eileen. I know. <laughs> oh, sucking my dick oh. as I sit in my car. <laughs> it's a Toyota Camry. Oh! <laughs> Thank you. 
Yet another practical use, yet another for, practical use for placenta. Smoothies or providing oh, nutrients to the developing fetus. Someone's made a placenta smoothie. It's it's a thing that Ow! Oh, Am I the only one in here that's seen a placenta a few feet away from me? Yeah. Well, I mean, I saw one right in front of my face, but it was 30 years ago. Make Your placenta smoothies. Any of y'all doing TwitchCon? Yeah. Maybe. You are? Maybe. Let's go. I'll bring a bunch of commander decks and force you to play with me. I don't know why I thought you were saying cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> bring a bunch of that, I'm gonna bring a bunch of cocaine. Oh, you gotta take that, that off. When you get there, you can't bring it with you. You want to San Diego for God's sake. <laughs> A great opening line to start a conversation with a stranger at a party. What time does the narwhal bacon? Or I play video games for a living. Oh, that's, that's, there we go. That's the chat I wanted right there. <laughs> <laughs> mm, using green text in Quiplash. The worst, the worst air freshener scent. Elon Muskie or ceramic <laughs> dicks. Off. <laughs> off. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I already voted. I love that. So that means there's one that's an on and one that's an off, and they no, have very distinct like sense. It's the bug it's spray off. off. Oh. I saw a uh, tweet yesterday that said Elon Musk is car notch, and it's all I've been able to think about. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> that's so good. That is all I've been able to think and about. And then I just type slash uh, subscribers, and I just leave that in the <laughs> chat box just in case. Just in case it needs to get entered into the chat. The, the official guy? medical term for <laughs> belly button lint, probably. The official medical term for belly it's button done. lint, probably. Fuzzy wuzzy. Fuzzy wuzzy belly jelly. Fuzzy wuzzy Aww. or belly jelly. <laughs> Horrible. I'm, both at the Amazing. Same time. Oh, I'm just does. pissed. Because everybody made fun of Elon Musk for not posting credit for that 2B art. Then I posted. Because you made that, right? Well, I posted that picture of Elijah Wood. From Lord of the Rings, and it said memegenerator.net in the bottom right, and everyone went, lol, memegenerator.net. What is it? Do you want your shit sourced or unsourced? They wanted <laughs> to laugh at him for liking stuff they think is funny. I guess. Oh no. Something you'd make a butler do the moment you hired him. Be my friend or suck 12 dicks. What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> but hear me out here. Suck 12 dicks off. <laughs> suck these 12 dicks off. Suck these 12 dicks off. 12 dicks off. <laughs> wanna suck these 12 dicks off? <laughs> <laughs> One for every hour of the day. Mm -hmm. What are you up to this weekend? <laughs> 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 That's actually the secret ending. I don't know. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to go all in on this joke. That's the secret ending to Kingdom Hearts 3, where you go up to Organization 13, and you're like, I'm going to suck all these 13 dicks off. Ooh. The scores. Nice. Sora. Yeah. No, Maybe no, I play no, the no, freaking no, game. No, no. <laughs> what? No. 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 All right. Not you, Ryan. You oh. We're gonna call on the gummy farm. Now round two. <laughs> are double the drama. I can't do it. That's Rob's voice. Holds up sport. <laughs> Let's take a look. I'm gonna First need to see a therapist Another after this game. Oh no. Another name for Canada. Okay. Northy Coldland or America's freaking hat. Come on, guys. Let's try Justin. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I'm not so disappointed in myself now. <laughs> Just to wait till the America prompts. That's mouth right there. That's like very one. northy. It's not. That's not you. No, because you'd be our pants. You wouldn't be your. Pants. Yeah, you'd be our underwear. Yeah. Gulf of Mexico is where my skid marks go. I was doing the Dan Gaisling Canada names joke with that. Oh. The worst, the worst thing, thing to do when a bear, when is, a bear right is right next to you. <laughs> Have a picnic basket or get out of its house. Is that a deep Goldilocks cut? I don't understand. <laughs> oh, I was trying to boy. think of something funny with bear here, but I was like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what the worst thing to do. I got the prompt and I didn't know what to do. <laughs> Telling you to suck these dicks off. Yeah. Sucking my own dicks off. Man, Goldilocks <laughs> was really a. 
dumb bitch. <laughs> Brian! Wow. She broke into a bear's house to sit <gasps> in a fucking chair. Don't tell me I'm wrong. Well, She's dumb, dude. Mm -hmm. She takes naps in her bed <laughs> and shit. <laughs> How would you fall asleep in someone else's bed when you after you rob them? Mm. Those bears are just shit neighbors. They should have let her <laughs> sit on that chair. She was fucking tired and hungry. <laughs> the worst combination of two actors that could possibly star in the next season of True Detective together. Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen, or Tom Cruise and Jean Claude Van Dance. I didn't even notice the typo. Oh, it's it's not no, a typo. It's, it's a like typo. a callback. It was it was a code names if that helps. Van and Dance were on the board, and I said Jean Claude. Something fun to ask the old wise man on top of the mountain. When's the beef? It's voting time. Or how much money do you make? <laughs> <laughs> Really, like, when's the beef? It's so wholesome. Do you have a plot? Hey, no, ask Where's the beef? Where's the beef? <laughs> Why is Gamora? <laughs> <laughs> Holds up, Spork. In a no one ever asks, how's the beef? That three out of four Sometimes people do. They go, how's the beef? That's true. Oh, he's right. your I like the deli. In a shocking poll, it was discovered that three out of four Americans want a dick sucked on... Or it was discovered that three out of four Americans can't read this prompt. It's <laughs> oh, good. Oh, the parentheses makes it, yeah. man. Really strong parentheses today. <laughs> I've seen some weak parentheses in my time, but these these parentheses are really going hard. You need all those parentheses. <laughs> so who's the three out of the four then? <laughs> That's... But uh, uh, it's not, uh, you know, I think I said it was five means. of us. Oh no, it is four. Three out of four Americans are canceling their what top the rights right now. Is that robe? <laughs> <laughs> Time to vote. What the Statue of Liberty is hiding beneath that robe? Dangly boobs or three sets of nipples? <laughs> Dangly boobs is a good name for a ska band. <laughs> Oh, sure, wrong. it's gotta be out there. Give me three sets, give me three sets. <laughs> is, three, is three sets of nipples six nipples? Yeah. I gotta get Let some opinions it. on this. What is and a tit? <laughs> <laughs> In your mind, what part of the body is a tit? Just the part that sticks out. I know it's a bird! Oh. Shut up, Chaz! That's not what I'm talking about. It's the mammary gland? Colloquialism. <laughs> Welcome. It's the, it's the, the, it's the whole thing. Yeah. No, it, we don't need There's the aerial oil. Prompt and you're all <laughs> you can just keep <laughs> down. We don't need it. Let's get rid of that thing. Get rid of it. We don't need it. A little known it's like you think the tit, that would be the whole boot, right? In my mind, that's what a tit is. Nah, it's a nipple. Just the nipple? No, cause, yeah, I guess there's something. Look at him. Titties. Big old titties. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You can't if it's somebody's like wearing a shirt. You can't just really see the nipple. I guess. Like, you're at the you're in the spelling bee and you just ask them to use it in a sentence. Ah, uh, them big old titties, you know them big titties. <laughs> uh, dude, that's a great bit. Uh, can you use the word in a sentence? Look at my fat titties. <laughs> you like these fat titties? <laughs> No, Are you Peter Griffin. <laughs> How about my side boob? <laughs> wow. What? Oh shit! He sounded so seductive. Oh well, he okay. is seductive. So sultry. A little-known lyric in the original draft of the Star Spangled Banner. Or the ramparts we fart. <laughs> we'll put a boot in your ass. Oh, say suck on these. I came, you can't see, by the cums. Look dash, at them dash, dash, dash. big old, old titties. <laughs> this titties. I gotta give all three to the one that went extremely hard. It's written so musically. I came, you I can't, can't you see, can. no, no, no. by the cums. Dash, 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 dash. You. Why you can't see? It's in the eyes. I gotta say, you guys have a cool anthem. Did we steal it from someone? Like, well, <laughs> the British oh, yeah, brother. <laughs>
The whole country kind of has that kind of yeah. about it. <laughs> now for wins. Oh, surprise, surprise. What a guy. Genuinely, yeah. <laughs> hey. He also had the top answer with want a dick sucked on. Yeah, well, that was worthy, yeah. <laughs> well, why don't we take some time to pimp our channels? All right. All right. Who are we starting with? Oh, fuck. Did he leave? I no, would no. never. Are you they sure? Leave. I think you, you might have just to make the the choice. Sick of I would comedy. never. That would be funny, though. Would it? Because I, I feel like it'd be like mean spirited. Dude, like if you, if one day, like I'm saying it out loud, so it's going to make it tougher to spring on us. But one day, if you said, what if we take some time to pimp our. Ch Oh, I appreciate. He, can't, he couldn't do it. I, I appreciate. Commit. Come on. I appreciate that you commit. built the moment. You'd have to pay us otherwise. The, that's the thing I was gonna say is you already get nothing out of being on this fucking show. So you, at least you get you know thirty seconds at the end without me shitting all over whatever you say. It's a, I mean, being real, I probably got a lot of my career and livelihood now to contribute to the exposure I've received over this past six years or fucking. so. But you know. Whatever, dude. It's you all should, you should have left again. That was the that was. That <laughs> really was a setup. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Just for that, we can start with uh, Bear Taffy. Hey, my shit's working. I'm super happy about that. All right, why don't, why don't you go next, uh, Justin? Hi, I got no sleep, and I was supposed to play Trials at nine, and then Rainbow Six at eleven. And I think I'm just gonna say fuck all that and just like go to bed in an hour. So we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> How? Dude, real quick though, I gotta give Ross some props because he's right. I never say my cha channel name anymore. There's new people here. They've they've never heard me before. My name's Bear Taffy, B A E R Taffy on Twitch. Come on by. I you're a new person. You never heard me before. Oh man, what a treat! Come on over. It's gonna be so much fun. Hey Bear, who the fuck is Ross? From friends. Uh, run it by me again. <laughs> friends. He's my friend. He's he just brought it up like we all know who Ross is. Ross Geller. Is it's in Ross chat. Geller? I thought he was talking about Bob Ross. No, it's just a guy in chat. It's his name Ross. Bobbert Ross. Say so guys chat name, just you know, acknowledge it and twitch.tv slash Ross. Past. Yeah. You know. The guy from Friends. Austin. Twitch.tv slash dumb dog. See Austin did it right. Yeah, well, I mean, I got a new name still, too, so I feel like I got to keep pumping that for, like, at least another, like, three months. Yeah. I still have the muscle memory where, like, uh, I keep trying to type your name, but I always type it. You'll get there. Wrong. Dude, Dan... I, I switched instantly. My my fingers were so grateful to me I didn't have to reach over to the underscore anymore. Dude, that's true. <laughs> I, it's, I, it's got to the point where Dan is doing it intentionally, and I don't think he knows that I know that he's doing it intentionally. <laughs> But I do. We all do, Dan. Yeah. Everyone does. I just like type people's Twitch names into my browser and let it autocomplete. But mm. for some reason, I constantly go to twitch.tv slash Oh, Lion. How's he doing? Google, I've gone there so many times that it's just ah, like Google like thinks that you want to go yeah. there, right? Yeah. Yep, yep. But I also still type the last every time and I go, oh, and then I switch it. <laughs> Look, it. Chat, if you want to dislike my new name, I can't stop you. But if you think the old name was better, I can stop you. That's insane. <laughs> You're insane. It's 12 syllables. No, we, we've gotten it down to two. Underscore three syllables. you got to say it twice. How about you? What the fuck was, was that? A WD-40. <laughs> How about you, your friend? Cobalt Street. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm Cobalt. Hello. Yeah, you know, I think I think most people are above average intelligence in your channel, so they know where the fuck to find me if they want me. That's all. Thank you. Yeah, I thought they were all idiots. That's why I did it. I might I might go give you a follow, Bear. Thanks. You know, after Might <laughs> <laughs> I'm already following him. How yeah. about you, Mouth? Um uh... I think um, most people are already decided oh, on what they feel about me, so... No, that's you know. not true. You can change opinions. Undecided. I saw you told that dude on my subreddit 
that you were going to make him eat your ass while shitting. <laughs> that was a joke, clearly. <laughs> Playful roughing around. <laughs> Probably the same guy who made a throwaway account to say that I ruined Team Unity the past <laughs> week. So, oh, no. Jesus. <laughs> don't worry. Uh, no, you know, I, if you're I, gonna I insult me, Unity. just say it to my face. Come to my stream, twitch.tv slash Michael Leo Fox, and be like, "You suck," and then you're not a coward because you said it to my face and you didn't say it on. You're just saying that subreddit. so you can ban them. Well, I know. There. I just want to feel the power. No. I got two you new know? follows. Somebody oh shit, dude! Nice. Came to my See, chat the other about. day and oh, they called me a bitch. I didn't no follow one. Or I didn't ban them. Did they Mouth talk? Huh? Eh? <laughs> Mel, if we got brand new people here, man. Like these people, raise your hand in chat if you've never seen the show before. This is your first time here ever in your life. They're all gonna raise their hand. I know. That's it's the joke. It's so funny.